how are you all i hope all of you are doing great and friends in today's video i'm going to address something which is really very important for the learners who wants to communicate who wants to articulate each and everything in a very good way who wants to be a good confident and fluent speaker so let me tell you what i am going to address in this video so friends in this video i am going to address which have been asked several times through my comments in my comment section i have seen many times several times single question is this grammar important to speak english fluently and if yes then how much grammar should we learn should we work on and if not then why so in today's video i am going to tell you everything if you are the beginner or you want to start your journey of learning and speaking english language then should you need should you need to focus on grammar from the very first day or it's important to ignore grammar in the very beginning of learning this language so friends without any further delay let's get into the video hello everyone this is yashoda welcome back to my channel and friends as you know in today's video what i am going to add this what i am going to talk about and this is really very important for all of us who really wants to have a good command over this language which is not our mother tongue which is a second language so friends let me tell you one thing the first question like is grammar important to learn this language or not so what do you think about this what's your answer in your opinion is grammar important to learn any language or not so i can say even earlier i also used to think like that there is no need to learn grammar however i must say there is need of learning grammar but the amount of grammar is depending on our level if you are at your beginner level okay then there is no need to concentrate too much on grammar because if you are the one who who focus too much on grammar then of course you are going to make lots of mistakes okay you are going to fumble a lot you are going to stammer a lot you are going to make lots of mistakes there is no doubt we have to work on grammar but not that much in the very beginning you know friends in order to start your spoken journey okay your english spoken journey you don't need to work on too much okay work too much on grammar because in order to start okay in order to start communication okay in order to speak with anyone we just need to uh work on only two or three basic concepts re related to grammar like tenses or models and then we can start speaking from the very first day from the beginning like let me tell you friends there are also role very big role of imperative sentences in grammar like imperative sentences means we can share we can express like if we want to give suggestion to anyone if you want to give order to anyone if you want to give advice to anyone then we we use imperative sentences like don't do this come go and you know come and go it may sound like these are verbs okay however i can say these are full sentences there is no need to put any kind of subject object no 
so in the same way if you want to start your speaking journey then you can start from the very first day okay after knowing only little bit grammar and then you just need to work on it gradually and eventually you will be able to understand each and every grammar rule you will be able to understand each and every structure which which is used okay which is used to learn speak english with that fluency and if you are able enough to elaborate whatever you want to speak in front of anyone then it means you are a very good speaker in my earlier days i didn't focused okay too much i didn't focus too much on grammar because i i knew that thing so if you are the beginner you also wants to start your journey then start giving attention to only one or two topics okay like tenses first you need to learn all 12 tenses and then learn about models because by using models we can share our feeling okay and after that then slowly slowly you need to learn everything related to grammar like participle past participle okay and active and passive voice conjunction preposition slowly slowly you will be able to learn everything you would learn everything but you must have your perseverance if you are kind of person who who does only procrastination then it means you are not going to become a fluent english speaker so just give your attention only on your goal because if you have set this goal for you that you just want to become a good communicator then you need to work on it no one is going to who will help you to accomplish this goal and friends we will meet in the next video till then bye bye keep learning keep focusing and keep practicing